<clears throat> I'm going to show you a really quick way in uh, adding a PDF file to your iPhone. What I tend to do is simply drag the PDF file into, if I can find it, there we are, preview, opens up in preview and this is a, this is just a, a magazine here, an online magazine and titled anti born so if I just go to file print take a minute to come up here and in your options here you can see that uh, we're looking at it in portrait mode I'm just gonna flip it over put it back into uh, landscape mode and then from your drop down PDF drop down box there there's a a link it says save PDF to iPhoto and off it goes. Now you'll see up in the taskbar at the very top there it says render PDF pages uh, oh too quick, uh, it's importing the files into iPhoto we've got a little red, there we are, just got the little click to say cool uh, I'll just open iPhoto let me close this, minimize that and here in iPhoto, we've got, we've got all those pages, those individual PDF pages, and they've put it into an album called Album. And I'll just rename it to Anti Anti Born. So once that's done, uh, I'll just minimise that, and it's a, just a matter of jumping into iTunes. Once you've got your a uh, iPhone connected. <coughs> Just nip over into photo section and I'll go look for it. Right down there, right at the bottom, I've got anti born. Click apply and there we have syncing process. And as we can see in the screen, it's optimizing um, the images. So, what it's actually doing is creating um, there we are. It's creating an image for for each page. So I'll just disconnect it here. Be a good boy and disconnect it that way. And pop this open. And if we can just see this, um, like photos. There's Anti Born. Doof. There we are. That's it. Easy peasy.